nasza wyspa. Com. Can you tell me a little bit more about your project, DJ School? Well, we've been running the DJ School, but it's getting so popular now that we have to expand. And I have uh, friends in the favela that uh, we're trying to raise money to buy a community center. Uh, we want to buy a building and make it into a community center and expand the DJ School. We want to have a, a room for production where students can sit and produce music on computers. We want to have a recording studio, English classes, art classes, jewelry making, any kind of classes that can benefit the community. And of course, these classes would all be free. So that's the next project that we're working on. We're saving money and we're working with Loughborough University in England and other people to try to raise probably about 50,000 pounds would so, be the idea. So, so you are planning buy the building here in Hosea, uh, yes? Yes, we would like to buy the building here in Hosea. There's several places that we've looked at, but there's one that seems it would be the perfect location and the price would be a, about right and we could expand. It's two floors right now, but we could expand and build up another floor. So can, that's can something. You, can you tell me exactly about this project? What are you are planning to do there? Well, we want to create a, a community center and have several different classes that you know engage the community so you know things like art classes english entrepreneurship classes women's health classes yoga we want to expand the dj school with a production room and a, a recording studio so the idea is to use money through tourism to build something that will be everlasting you know i want my legacy to be you know if i were to you know die in a few years i want to be able to leave something behind that that benefits the community. So if somebody wants to help, how, how, how they can help you? How, how they can uh, send you the money or give you the money? Or... In terms of people wanting to help, um, I've organized things with Pavel and Karen. There's also uh, fundraising efforts being taken through Loughborough University. I don't want anybody to send me any money. The object is that this is uh, you know, I want it to be a transparent thing. So I'm trying to involve people, you know, that that will be able to help. I don't want any, I don't want any money directly sent to me. They could contact myself at visithasina at gmail.com and I can send them more information. Or they could contact Karen or Pavel, or or they could contact Loughborough University, which I have contacts with all these people. So if you contact me and you want to know more about the fundraising efforts contact me and then I'll, I will refer you to the people that are handling the financial side. The object is I'm, I'm raising 70,000 reais of my own money and then outside people are going to raise money and then we're going to put our money together. The object is to buy the building together. I don't want anybody like giving me money. So it's a joint project with foreigners and then people from the favela. So how, how much money you exactly need it? Probably about 50,000 pounds. Well, thank you very much for the really short interview. Well, thank you very much. And Appreciate I wish you have a nice, great day. And you too. Thank you so much.